Hey, this is Jay. I'm David. I'm David. And our project is cracking WPA encryption. To crack WPA encryption, we are using the free aircraft package running on Linux, Fedora Core to capture a WPA handshake and perform a dictionary attack against it. First, we have to disable a wireless adapter, and then enable the adapter in monitor mode so that it captures all input traffic. Using the arrow dump app, we first need to identify the MAC address of an access point and its channel on the wireless network that we are trying to crack. Dash W just specifies the file name to save arrow dump's output, in. but in this case it's not needed and MON2 specifies the interface we are listening on. Once we have the MAC address and channel of the access point, we can start listening to the traffic to and from it. Now that we are listening to the traffic, we can either wait for a handshake to occur or disconnect something using the access point to force it to reconnect, which is what we're doing here. You can see that AeroDump captured the WPA handshake now and we are ready to perform our dictionary attack. Aircraft Recart requires a dictionary file with the dash w argument and the MAC address of the access point with the dash v argument and the file containing the WPA handshake. Even though cracking WPA was relatively easy in this case, you should understand that, as with any pre-shared key and encryption method, the encryption is only as secure as the key selected, so it is important for administrators and end users to select strong keys. Also notable is the potential for denial of service attacks against the wireless networks, either directed against a client, as demonstrated in this video with the Air Replay app, or against an access point by continuous reconnection attempts. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Does anybody have any questions? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God.